Welcome to Mr. O'Connell's lesson videos where we're going to review what we covered in the lesson for this week. So this being the first week of viola lessons, we're going to re review the parts of the instrument, we're going to review posture and how to stand with the instrument, and, and plucking. We're going to review how to, uh, the names of the, of the strings and, uh, and a little chant that goes along with each string. So I'd like to begin with, the, with going with reviewing the parts of the instrument. The first, uh, the first thing, this swirly thing on top is called the scroll. This is the neck, the body. This long piece of black wood here that runs up and down the instruments, the fingerboard. We have the bridge, the tailpiece, uh, the chin rest, and the button down here. That's that little dot there is called the button. Okay, so I'd like to begin with posture. So we want to begin in rest position with our instrument underneath our right arm, just like that. Scroll facing forward, bridge facing out away from you, okay? Now, we're going to begin with viola feet. So just remember with that, I know you can't see my feet, but what we went over today is you want to keep uh, both feet together, and then you want to keep your heels together, but you're going to bring out your toes, okay? Point out your toes, and now step out with your left foot, okay? Step out with your left foot, so your feet are a little bit separated now, okay? That's viola feet. The next thing you want to do is called Statue of Liberty. So take this hand, come across your body on the body of the instrument, and then bring the viola out like this to Statue of Liberty. Chin up, aim the button of the instrument for the middle of your neck, okay? Right in the middle of your neck. Very good. Now, you want to make sure you're standing up nice and tall, okay? Take your, take your free hand, your right hand now, give it thumbs up and go across your body to the side of the fingerboard, okay? And then now you shoot up your first finger like a firework. Boom! That's your index finger, okay? You're going to pluck each string three times with a little space between each string, okay? One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Okay, so three times. And now I'm going to teach you a little chant that's going to go along with each string, okay? And it's going to help us to remember the names of each string. Now, there's a, each string has a name, and it's a letter, okay? So I'll teach you the chant first, and then, I'll, then we'll remind ourselves the name of each string, okay? So it goes like this. Ants, 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 go marching down, 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 into the ground, 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 playing their cellos, 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 okay? So that's ants, that's A, that's the A string. The, uh, go marching down, that's the D string, into the ground, that's the G string and then playing their cellos. That's the C string, C for cello. So we have ants, 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 go marching down, 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 into the ground, 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 playing their cellos, cellos, cellos. That's it, excellent job. Now we're gonna go back to Statue of Liberty, across your body, rest position. So that's it, that's it for this week. Um, I hope you enjoyed and uh, keep on working hard. I look forward to seeing you next week. Thanks very much.